Popular veteran Q Card has been retired, assistant trainer Joe Tizard has announced. The 12 year old had been due to make a final appearance in the Bet 365 Oxy Chase at Sandown on April 28, but he has failed to sparkle since being pulled up in the Ryanair Chase at the Cheltenham Festival. We've taken the decision this morning to retire Q Card. He wasn't working quite as well as he can, and we didn't want to take him to Sandown if we weren't 100% happy with him, Tizard told Coral. The 2015 King George winner, who has been on the go since his four year old season, will now be paraded at Sandown on the final day of the national hunt season. Tizard added, We will still take him to Sandown to parade him, and to celebrate a great career. He has been an incredible horse for us and now he can look forward to a new chapter in his life. Q card first hit the headlines when winning the champion bumper at the festival in 2010 before lifting a grade 2 novice hurdle and being placed at both Cheltenham and Aintree the following season. However, he really came into his own as a chaser, winning twice as a novice before landing the Haldon Gold Cup. Aska Chase and Ryanair Chase in his first full season over fences. Stepped up and trip for the 2013 14 campaign. He won the Bitfair Chase at Haydock for the first time, a race he would claim on a further two occasions in his career. He was at his best in the 2015 16 season, though, when he won the Charlie Hall at Weatherby and the Bitfair Chase before adding the King George at Kempton after a thrilling battle with Botour. Heading to the 2016 Gold Cup, he was the 5 2 joint favourite and on the verge of a £1 million triple crown bonus but he fell three fences from home when still traveling well. Q Card's last win came in the Ascot Chase in February 2017 and he bows out having won 16 of his 41 races, 9 at grade 1 level, with almost £1.5 million in prize money to his name.